Physics is weird, it's mind-blowing, it's amazing, and it's intriguing, and like it's just different. It's never really completely what you expect it to be. I really enjoy that. I like knowing that not everything is exactly as it seems, and I like studying that. Teaching goes hand in hand with scientific discovery. Students get so excited when they're learning something new, when for them it's the discovery of not only that piece of information, but how it fits in. The questions that, that we all ask when we're really little, and then a lot of people when they grow up they forget, like why is the sky blue? That's an important question. Claire Thomas is a sophomore undergraduate in the physics department. Claire comes to the classroom with lots of energy. She's very excited about the work. I think Professor Goldberg is an inspiration, actually. Every time I'm impressed at how he can simplify something to really, I'm like, oh, I never would have thought to, to explain that that way. As an undergraduate, she's already achieved that, that kind of seamless flow between, you know, getting your ideas right and getting your effort right and getting your excitement right. And uh, she joined my laboratory and she's been doing research there too. Here in the lab under Professor Goldberg, I work on this two-dimensional carbon material called graphene. Graphene is a very small piece of graphite, actually. It's exactly the same graphite that is used in your pencil. And if you rub a pencil on a piece of paper, what happens is that the graphite that's in that pencil comes out on the surface of the paper, and it just sort of flakes off and leaves a line. And what was discovered um, in 04 and 05 is that if you take a piece of scotch tape onto these little platelets, you can, in fact, literally strip off one atom at a time. For an undergraduate, this is a great connection, right? Because they go home at night and they're looking at their pencil and then they go back to the lab the next day and, you know, a tiny piece of that one atom thick is sitting there. And so that I think is really cool. That's like a mind-blowing concept. And may be important for technology. We try to give an undergraduate research experience to every student. Research opportunities here are great for, for young undergraduates. I got this job this summer after my freshman year. I hardly knew any physics and I was just thrown in and I got to learn and, and explore kind of a lot on my own and in a very unconventional way. In the lab, one of the most fun things is taking data, seeing spectra, taking images and realizing or thinking that maybe that's the first time. Maybe that's never been seen before and maybe that is really important. And then there's so many unanswered answered questions still in physics. We don't know what makes up 80% of the natural world. Young physicists can be like, I'm going to solve this problem and I'm going to get the Nobel Prize for that. And it doesn't really matter if, if we are or are not going to get a big prize or recognize, but the fact that everyone here still is still yearning to answer those questions is something that I really like.